Smith on the outside. And ultimately, you talk about Cougar greats. Look how he compares, Tom, to some of the Cougar greats in his sophomore season. I really am impressed with that completion percentage. They like to push the ball downfield. And I, I think it speaks to his decision-making and his comfort level in this offense. And the key season as well. Second down and two. Mansion. All battled down at the line of scrimmage. Travis Long, the 6'4 sophomore out of Gonzaga Prep in Spokane, getting a hand to attack. So the second, third down opportunity on this opening drive for Cal. Mansion out of the gun. Getting some pressure and going down. C.J. Mizell right at the gut. The freshman, former Florida State University recruit. He has moved into the Cougars lineup, and he made an impact right there. Well, a lot of this guys, who's coming, who isn't, C.J. Mizell takes advantage of a miscommunication up front for the Cal Bears and delivers a blow, not only figuratively, but literally to block Brock Mansion. And it's funny what happened. Second down and 10. Marine. And nothing there. C.J. Mizell leading the attack. And Jason, he's off to a terrific start in this game, Mizell. Well, one of those guys that the Cougar coaching staff is really excited about. He's had some maturity issues and kind of folding into the, the, the college atmosphere, but he's really come on. And again, so many of these Cougar playmakers are young, and this coaching staff has said, you know what, we're throwing them on the field to get experience, and you got to take your lunch with the youthful mistakes they make, but you also see what... ...with Vereen. Wildcat formation. Green. Looking for some room and not much there. He tries to reverse field and forget about it. Tackle that time by Bernard Wolfgram for Washington State. And the Cougars do a terrific job denying Cal on third down. But they slanted into the formation, and I think, you know, I've always felt that Wildcat play, especially when you're lined up without any sort of player advantage. Tool keeps the football out to the 25 and gets down head first out near the 26. Darian. You want to feature his talents. You want to limit the amount of hits that he gets. And early on in this game, he's been taking his share. Option to the left. Nitz, the ball player. Fumbled the football, but out of bounds. As he picks up a first down, Cameron Jordan, the first of the Bears to get there, to put the hit on Mitts. Yeah, Cameron Gain Jordan for a defensive end is a special player. I mean, look at this guy able to run sideline to sideline and put the, the wood on Logmon Mitts. He's a guy that gets it done both in the run. Arizona is Cameron Jordan. He's a good one. Four receivers out for two. Has the completion of Marquise Wilson. Out to the 44-yard line. Darian Hagan with the coverage. To so take a look at uh, the early start of the second quarter, Washington State with the football, operating against the Golden Bears defense. Tool keeps it, and Tool has a lot of room. Tool at the 30, and first down near the 25-yard line. Jeff Tool with an outstanding running play. Doesn't have great speed, but boy, that's terrific execution as Jeff picks up 22 yards. Well, it really frees Cameron Jordan, that backside defensive end, did not see it coming. Great block by Richmond, and Jeff Tool's athleticism takes over, and he probably should have gotten a flag there. You saw him. This drive that started at their own 20 continues. LeGuan Mitz powering down near the finish, but we are scoreless here at Martin Stadium. Two of pump things. He's going to run it again right up the middle. And two with the first down. DeAndre Coleman, redshirt freshman out of Garfield High School in Seattle, making the stop, but not before two gets the first down. And right at the 10-yard line, so first and goal, Washington State. And that's a great adjustment to Cal's over-pursuit of those little bubble screens, those outside plays, already adjusting to the way to the Cal Bears playing this afternoon. Two of five carries for 40 yards. Miss! Touchdown, Washington State!
Seven nothing. Cougars in Pullman. Carstetter in motion. Resets. Chance stayed in the ball carry. Number 22. He's got some room coming back inside. Let's see if they mark him as stepping out. They do at the mark left to play here in the first half. It's Isaiah Barton in motion. Tool getting some heat right at the middle. Gets out of it. Looking for that first down mark and lunges for it. Being chased by Sean Catoose. And it's a first down, Washington State. Folks, you want to talk about a baller. That's the definition of number 10. I mean, this guy just fights to the very last minute and somehow, some way, makes a play for his team when they need it. What a great individual effort by uh, And he didn't have a choice that time, but, but tucking that ball away sometimes and maybe just running it. See, that time finds Marquise Wilson. On a heck of a job by Isaiah Barton to pick up that block, the same block that he missed. Time he gets it. Truly is a game of inches here. Watch how close this guy comes to making a play. Great job driving him out, and then Marquise Wilson gets the rest done with his legs. And Cougars have a. I am told that when you come to Pullman, you better make time to stop at the Cougar Country Drive In. Burgers, shakes, and fries. That's what our crew did yesterday. And when they get serious, damage can be done. You've eaten there. I haven't. I, I, I've been there, and I know that two alums are watching that right now. They're salivating <laughs> involuntarily. That, that may be a stop out of town as we. Second down and six. A terrific stop. Technique tackling by the junior out of Los Angeles. But how many other guys can rally to the football to help you out? You see a lot of crimson jerseys on top of Shane Vereen. And has a long of 66 this season. Eric Justin getting under it at his own 40. And has a seam. And has a lot of room. Air Justin takes it inside the California Golden Bear 30 yard line before Jared Sparks makes the tackle. It's one of the better special teams returns this season for the Washington State Cougars. Boy, after making that first guy miss, you know, anger, the one bad thing about a guy that's got a leg like that is you really stretch out your coverage team and create a lot of running lanes. Air Justin. A nice job making that first guy miss. Picks up a couple blocks. And the rest is his. And what a heck of a job creating even better field position. Than Jeff Tool too much. So after the great punt return and amazing field position, the Cougars go backwards and now forced to long field goal try. 51 yard try by Andrew Fernie, the freshman. He forced with the hole. The kick is long enough. And it's good. Andrew Fernie from 51, the longest field goal of his young career. And the Cougars reclaim the lead. Manchin out of the shotgun. To the right. Jeremy Ross. A little hurdling out across the 30, but C.J. Mizell stands him up and drives him back. Back to the line of scrimmage is California. Manchin with time. Intercepted by Washington State. And dropped down is Nolan Washington. That ball looked like it was thrown right to him. Yeah, you see Brock Manchin trying to throw with timing, but clearly the route that he was throwing was not the route that Calvin was running. And great play by Nolan Washington just sitting on that route. You see Brock Manchin trying to affect the defense with his eyes. He's not locked onto the receiver, but Clearly, he did not recognize the coverage because Nolan Washington was in a trail technique with his eyes in the backfield, just a basic zone coverage. They took care of Lewis Clark State. Tool on second down. Trying to get out of trouble and does. Lunges forward near the 30. Washington. As the Cougars have already gone past their per game average of 73. Tool. 
Wilson, terrific catch by Marquise Wilson, but a flag on the play near the line of scrimmage. We talked about the big play Wilson. capability of Marquise Wilson. Offside defense. Only six five. Result of the play. First down. 24 yard gain on the fade route to Wilson. The thing I like about this is Jeff Tool throws this when Marquise Wilson hasn't even uh, eaten up the cushion yet. See, watch him. He's even and he's leaving. Great speed by Marquise Wilson. Nice job getting it at the top of the arc of that path. Richmond in motion. Tool keeps the football. Has a nice pickup on first down, down to the 41 yard line. His defense has allowed six of ten on fourth down. Gino Simone with the catch and the first down for Washington State. DJ Holt and Guyton with the stop for California. Four yard gain, just enough for the Cougars. They've really looked to Gino Simone when they need to get the needed yard is on third and fourth down to see him just run a little slant pattern. And now Simone apparently shaken up. Sophomore out of Skyline High School in Sammamish, Washington. A little state football power. Back of the head, maybe onto the turf. Well, I, I they have think. Shaken him up a bit, or maybe it was helmet to helmet with DJ Holt. Well, and Trevor Guyton came from that defensive end spot and really laid into him as. Upper treatment and making sure players do not come back too soon. There's oh. a hit right there, 92. It was helmet to helmet. Guyton. And Simone and replay officials are reviewing this play to see if he had control of the football. There really is a definitive angle right there. And then the head also makes contact on Barnes as he continues to get checked out. California with a 14 and 10 lead, 521 left in the third with the football. First down and 10 and the pitch to Shane Vereen and CJ Mizell. That could have been a very dangerous play as he lifted Shane Vereen and threw him down to the turf with tremendous force. Well, you want to talk about just sheer strength. This is determination, and the WWF is calling. Loss on the play of a yard. C.J. Mizell, the freshman middle linebacker for the eye to the left. Manchin looking for Vereen, and it may have been picked off. It was Air Johnson, Air Justin, excuse me, Air Justin with the pick as Manchin throws his second interception in this game. Well, you gotta like the way Air Justin is stepping up to the challenge. Great receivers at Cal, a poor throw, but a nice job by Air Justin looking back for that football and making a super athletic play. Again, Air Justin playing today in that starting role because Daniel Simmons had a freak shoulder injury on Thursday. And boy, is he making the most of his opportunity. Now you've got to get this Cougar offense to make the most of an opportunity. Without having ever taken a varsity snap at quarterback, Tom, it just speaks to his potential and what the coaches saw. And Isaiah Barton with a first down catch. And man, how about some zip on the football that time from Jeff Toole as he split a couple of defenders as the Cougars can ball and gets into the last second. Here's this one, Isaiah Barton. One of those passes you wonder, how did that sneak through? And a great job of concentration by the Jimmy Carlin transfer, Isaiah Barton. Jeff Tedford right here. You want to, that's a face mask penalty, first of all. But uh, I don't think that he's going to get the flag thrown because he's the head coach, and that is just a poor decision by Harrell. You think the point was driven across there? Yeah, listen to this. Unbelievable contact by Dayon Buchanan. I don't, I don't think Cefeli was real sure where he was. Here it is live. And Air Justin coming in. Screen over the middle to Ross. He will not 
try to get the first down, but how much will he get? He's still on his feet, still driving down. And maybe he does get the first down. Let's see, this is going to be a very interesting.